Hello again, I'm David Elzinga. And I'm Peter Dupont. We're the co-chairs of the Asia Clean Energy Forum 2019 or ASEF 2019. Happy New Year. And today we'd like to share a few of new ideas that we're trying to use to enhance ASEF. So we're changing things up a little bit this year. We are having an integrated approach to our discussions at ASEF, building on ADB's new strategy 2030, which is focusing on integrating operations across sectors. So the thematic tracks this year, instead of being energy efficiency and renewable energy and energy access, they will be energy in cities, energy in water, energy in poverty alleviation, uh, energy in finance. And we also have a new track on clean energy research trends, David. Yeah, that's right. In we believe that this approach is critical to addressing the energy needs of Asia. And this means looking at energy and water, as, as Peter mentioned, or how do we make our cities more livable? How do we make uh, gender more inclusive across the work that we do? And lastly, how do we look at the new trends and apply them practically in Asia? So we'd like to invite you, all of you out there, to submit an abstract. We'll issue the call for abstracts in early February and we want to hear from you about your knowledge and lessons learned, but really more from a personal level, we want to hear your stories, your stories about successes, achievements, and even failures. What did you learn from those failures and how can your uh, fellow practitioners at ASEF learn from you? So last year when we did the call for abstracts, we had over 340 submissions for just 16 sessions. So I really need to encourage you to put your best foot forward bring your greatest ideas. And we need those ideas to be really more practical than theoretical. Really, what are your ideas? What are some of the innovations that can be shared across uh, different practitioners, different countries? How can these be replicated and used to really support development in Asia? So this is a shout out to all of you clean energy practitioners out there. Whether you're in rural development, whether you're working on mini grids, whether you're working on software solutions for or uh, Internet of Things, whether you're a project developer, uh, big chip financer, or working in microfinance. We want you to share uh, information about ASEF across your networks. You can start by signing up for the newsletter and you can follow us on social media. Another thing we're doing this year that we wanted to highlight is uh, we're going to work really hard to get greater gender inclusivity. So we're really encouraging women energy professionals to submit abstracts this year. And we're serious about this and we're making a pledge to have no man-only panels or manals as part of this conference. We want to ensure that we have gender diversity across all the panels when we talk about clean energy in Asia. So we look forward to hearing from you as we partner in impact for ASEF 2019. And you'll hear more updates for us in our next video.